So a while back, one of my uh, subscribers comments like, you know, you've never done a video about your nighttime routine. And I thought, I have it. It's time, guys. So welcome. My name is Brian. This is my Beards and Banjo's YouTube channel. We're going to try to help you grow your best beer possible. Thank you so much for joining me. And we are getting closer and closer to 2,000 subscribers. When we get there, we're going to be doing a giveaway of a Brio Beardscape version 2. So make sure you're subscribed and check out that video so you can leave a comment and be entered into that giveaway. So the main reason I've never done a nighttime routine is it's, it's not that complicated, at least for me. I pretty much I put in a little oil or a little butter and that's about it. Video over. Just kidding. We're going to go into a little more detail than that, but uh, that's what I do now. Sometime in the evening, I'll also go through my aggressive brushing technique uh, routine usually. So I did a video on that. You can go back and check it out, but that's pretty much going to get something against my skin and give me a little bit of exfoliation. It's going to spread any of those uh, natural sebum oils that's like stuck against your skin. It's going to spread it throughout your beard a little bit more. And then if I'm using butter, uh, I like putting the butter in, if I can, about 30 minutes before bedtime. And I use uh, light butters that are non-greasy, no wax in them, um, and something that usually absorbs in pretty quickly. So uh, I do like whipped butters, but they're becoming harder and harder to find. One of the best on the market, I think is still on the market, uh, and that is from Captain Stash. So you can check that out. By the way, uh, I've got links uh, and, and in every video, I have all my affiliate links and, and a codes to use. They're down in the, in the description of every YouTube video I do. So if you ever want to know if I've got a discount for something, just check out any video. It's real easy to find. Uh, I also like Iowa Beer Company's butter because it's, a, it's kind of a hybrid. The ingredients are mixed or blended together, but it's not highly whipped. Uh, absorbs into my beard very easily. And a lot of times I'm testing stuff for companies. Uh, so if I'm testing out stuff, as long as it's not a real heavy scent, I don't like really heavily scented things. Uh, most of the time companies send me unscented anyway, but I kind of prefer that at night. Uh, I do like a few type of scents. Uh, Iowa Beer Company has one called Snake Oil, uh, and, they, and they've got some others that are seasonal. The winter is coming, but I like mint scents, a little bit of a light citrus, something like that. So snake oil is all essential oils, and it's got a nice citrus uh, vibe to it, kind of outdoorsy citrus vibe, if you will. I also like, um, and a lot of times, especially in the, in the summertime here lately, I've been going just oil only. So if I'm doing that, I like the thicker oil, something's going to last a long time. Um, so I got Artie's man here. These are about... Uh, both of these are less than uh, less than half full, but that's your winter's chill. This one's unscented. I also have uh, the tea tree mint. Those are the ones that I use the most uh, if I'm going oil only. <clears throat> um, I also like mythical beards. Uh, they've got their uh, emu blend, but also their original blend. The original blend's also nice and thick, uh, kind of like artist man, maybe just a little bit less thick than that. Uh, you also have uh, Damn Yankee. They've got their Sterling Blend Oil. That's one where you can use in the daytime. You don't you don't even need any butter or balm or anything like that. So it's good to last all night. And then the one I've been using the most is a sample here that's just about out. When I don't, I'm not testing anything else out. I don't really want to put in butter. I just throw in a little bit of this oil. I've found for me that uh, the Emu Ostrich Blends work really well at night. It kind of mimics your own a natural sebum oil very well for me. Uh, and this is the one from the Bearded Mac. I think it's called the Premium Line. I can't remember off the top of my head, uh, but I don't have the, uh, the after it was released, this was testing behind the scenes here and the bottle said number 20 on it. So uh, Chris always does a really good job of research and development. And this was the winner and it was uh, it's a winner for me too. I have to pick up some more of that before I go on vacation because I have a feeling that's what I want to take with me for nighttime. Don't have to worry about taking butters and stuff on a vacation with me. And when I put in the products, that the oil or the butter, I put in just a little bit less than what I would put in uh, in the morning, like before I go about my day. Uh, and I try to put, you know, the oil I can put in like right before bedtime. So we usually go lay in the bed for, you know, 20 minutes watching TV or something before we go to sleep. So I don't have to worry about getting anything right on my pillow right off the bat. But you have to be careful with the butter. If you put too much butter, uh, you can have a greasy pillowcase in the morning if you're not careful. The only other thing to consider is when do you wash your beard? Like if you wash your beard at night, 
what what do you do? Like I, I'm a morning, uh, uh, take a shower in the morning, so I don't really have to worry about it. I do a, a full reset. So should you style your beard at night if you wash your beard at night? Kind of depends. You guys are gonna have to let me know what works for you. If you shower at night, you don't shower in the morning. Maybe you wash your beard or you just get it wet again in the morning. So I could I could see a case for maybe styling out your beard at night if you are not doing a full reset the next morning. I think most guys have longer beards or it's already trained. Uh, you use good products, so you don't really need to worry about that. But I can see the case where if you 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 know you wash your beard, you put in a little bit of oil, but yet you've got really curly beard and uh, it can kind of get out of whack overnight. So that would be the only time I would consider possibly doing some styling of your beard at night. Other than that, you don't really need to. So let me know if I missed anything, anything else to consider. I don't do anything too out of the ordinary, a little oil or a little butter. Uh, I do make sure I'm combing everything out. I use that aggressive uh, brushing technique, not always right before bedtime, but sometime in the evening, I like doing that as well. So let me know if you guys do something different and I appreciate you guys watching. And as always, uh, we'll see you soon.